Blessed be and greetings. This year I have three important trips that we are scheduled to make. We are doing In Search of Merlin Stone a DVD. We are looking at people and gathering information and interviewing people who have met Merlin Stone, who have benefited from her teachings. I myself must say that without her, I would have only mythology to stand upon and not really um, social studies, which she has conducted. She gave us science underneath the goddess mythology, so we have somewhere to put our feet. And she has shown us that around the world, globally, the goddess was worshipped as is now male gods. In the goddess uh, orientation, the world did not hurt themselves and each other. Women were respected on the male gods. It's just the opposite. Women are discounted, and nobody loves women right now. All this comes from religion. When you change consciousness, you change the world. It is especially true for women. So we are going to New York and talk to friends there. And then we go to the Glastonbury Festival, which is in um, England. And we're going to do a presentation there about the women's spirituality movement in the USA. And we are doing a Dianic Circle with women only as usual. Then we go back to Hungary after Glastonbury to explore where I come from. And we're going to video as much of my background there as we can, the hot springs, the, the buildings where I lived, and um, friends that I know. When that is over and we come back home, September 24th is the huge big memorial for Merlin Stone in Florida. Please look it up on our website and register as soon as you can. I like this to be a pilgrimage, a pilgrimage of all families still standing, young and old, to come and respectfully pay homage to the passing of Merlin Stone and all the others who have left without a proper goddess memorial. I don't want this to go on like that. I want us every year to gather somewhere and um, and remember those who have taught us something and gave us, gave us their work and love. Ooh.